The theme for Lantern Floating Hawaii is many rivers, one ocean. Each of us has a personal reason that leads us to this ceremony, but in a collective moment of remembrance, we come together to support one another like rivers merging into a great ocean. My mother-in-law just passed away um, in March, and we, the whole family, we miss her dearly. And for some reason, I've always had this unended feeling, like I wanted to talk to her. I don't know. I just, I just need to be here. I just felt that need to be here. Every year, we come and we, we write our notes on our lanterns and we let them out. Just for remember them on Memorial Day. Our grandparents and friends that pass and work co-workers that pass. Emotional, nothing make me feel real spiritual. But ever since I came the first time, it became a repeated thing. How do I feel during the ceremony? That's it's a roller coaster. It's a beautiful roller coaster. I feel really sad. I feel really happy knowing that my loved ones know that I'm thinking about them. Uh, it does bring closure at the time. It brings peace. A good brother just passed away, Chino Montero, also. Uh, oh, he's a fellow musician, so all yeah. the musicians all together. All the, yeah, all the musicians over here. And dancers all in this area. So. My, like my grandfather passed away when I was a kid, and actually I, I must have been six years old, but I remember crying on the couch. So at that time, I, I guess I didn't even understand what, what death was, but I kind of had that feeling that you, you lose somebody that you care about and they're never going to come back. You can never see them again. The first time it, sh it came to Hawaii was in 1999, and that was at Kei Lagoon, actually. So it started off really small, and then over the years it's grown and been accepted and um, supported by so many in the community. I mean, we're talking 45,000, 50 people, the beach is packed. We actually have a lot of volunteers, and we rely a lot on volunteers. It's all by donation, and it doesn't start with just here. It starts. Uh, months before when we're actually preparing the lanterns, each lantern is prepared by hand. It gives people that feeling like no matter where we come from, we all have that shared experience and we all understand. It has no bearings of what religion you are, it doesn't matter what race you are. It, it, it has nothing to do with that. It's all about coming together and honoring someone that you cared about that has passed. And then to me, that's what's so special about it because we can talk about things all we want, but when you see things in action, you see people coming together, that's what makes it real for me. And it, it feels like, you know what? This kind of peace that, that people all wish for, it is possible. <laughs> Thank you.